Hi guys, this is Miss Equa. I'm back with my ninth graders curriculum choices. Um, I'm going to start and just jump right in. Um, first thing he'll do every morning is he will do a daily devotion. And that comes from uh, BibleGateway.com. They have an audio, a morning and evening audio devotional. So um, actually my older children will be doing this every day for Bible. I want them to get into the um I want to make it a habit for them to start their early morning devotion and make sure they're giving Yahuwah the um, thanks and praise that they um, need to do every morning. So we will be doing that. Um, for Bible study, we use um, padfield.com. Like I said, I'll link everything below. It's a complete Bible curriculum starting from the Old Testament from the beginning. It goes all the way through Revelation. Um, he would also do that after his morning devotion. He'll start doing that. For his math, um, we're using time for learning. Because of my son's um, learning disability, I always call I like to call it learning ability. <laughs> and his learning style of being a visual spatial um, learner, he actually has to have um, a lot of things computer generated and he thinks in graphs and charts and things like that. He has to have something visually stimulating. And anything that's um, on the computer or computerized will just tend to work better for him. So he'll be doing pre-algebra this year um, through Time for Learning and will also use, utilize this online math drill sites. And it's really a great site. It's a um, computer generated drill site for multiplication, multiplication tables, addition, subtraction, division, and things like that. And you can time it for them. So he'll be doing that also for math. For his English, I have the Treasures Grammar Book. Also, let me just open it up for you. Uh, the same one that my fifth grader is actually using. Let me see if I can focus in here. And um, I just printed out for him. I just used the sixth grade level for him uh, because that's where he is as far as grammar right now. So. I want him to give him the basics. I don't want to push him too much. And um, if he's working well on this and I see that he's mastering this, we'll move on to the next level. Um, for his language arts, complete language arts, we will be utilizing uh, time for learning for that also. Also, for his literature, he will be reading Black Beauty starting uh, as far as this year, uh, as soon as we start on Monday, he will be starting uh, to read Black Beauty. This is one of the picks that he'll be, uh, one of the picks that I've chosen for him. And also, right here is his literature guide that I got from the Kirklick sale that he'll use to go along with his um, literature study on Black Beauty. Also, there is a download online on lit to go Like I said, I'll link that also. It's an audio of the book Black Beauty. So he'll be using that along with that so that he can be able to actually hear it and read along at the same time. Now let's move on to his history. He will be doing the Discover Africa also. Um, I try to combine a lot of subjects as much as I can and what I do is I actually use it to um, they basically work at their own level. So that's what I like to do for my children, especially having a large family. I try to combine as many subjects. I know sometimes it's not, you can't, it's hard to do because sometimes the age difference is so vast. But I'll let you look at this again. It's the, the same thing my fifth grader is using. So it's, it's basically about the same. And that's Discover Africa. For his writing composition, we will be using Essentials in Writing. And that's his student text. Everything comes on DVD format where he can pop it into his computer and he can watch the lesson for the day. He's got a worksheet afterwards. It's all there placed in, uh oh, I'm sorry, my DVDs are scattered placed in this four disc DVD set and he'll watch the lesson 
and it'll teach him everything he needs to know as far as his writing composition and then it'll refer him to whichever page worksheet that he'll need to work on um, like I said for history again we're still doing the unit studies we're going to start in Africa and then we're going to do ancient Egypt and then we'll probably do the US uh, road trip from confessions of a homeschooler for his um, humanities humanities he will be um, doing music appreciation and with his music appreciation it's on the new easy peasy all-in-one he will do the ancient music on that website again like I said I will link that also below for his art appreciation he will be doing the easy peasy ancient art and um, also for his art he'll be doing studio art for teens like I said with me being a reviewer for the TOS schoolhouse review I get a free one-year subscription to schoolhouse teachers and on schoolhouse teachers they have different types of lessons and things like that and it's, it's really inexpensive to join if you you know decide that you want to join I'll link that below also but they have classes they have curriculum and I thought it would be great for him to do the studio art for, for teens and what it is he'll do different sketches it'll teach him how to draw uh, because he does have an interest in that now moving on for his science his science he'll be also working on apologia um, exploring creation with human anatomy and physiology of course I'll add um, unit uh, sorry not unit studies but lap booking and notebooking also with that and um, I think that's it for him right now oh as far as PE I do have um, a free PE curriculum that I will be linking also at the bottom through ACE Fitness ACE Fitness is a uh, personal fitness um, type uh, curriculum in school and my husband is a certified personal fitness trainer so he will be working with all of our children uh, as far as PE and um, they have a curriculum just for children and it is free and I will link that also below that he'll be using along with that and along with um, other things you know like karate uh, track and um, Wii Sports Wii Sports is phenomenal when it comes to PE, especially on rainy days and they can't get outside or they can't, uh, some uh, track practices is uh, canceled or baseball practices is canceled. They still have the Wii Sports. <laughs> so if you have a Wii, please utilize your Wii for PE. But um, that's it for him right now and stay tuned. I am coming with a video for my 11th grader. Thank you. Bye.